हेलो स्टूडेंट्स इन फर्स्ट पी एस सी बायोलॉजी मोस्ट ऑफ द मेजर क्वेश्चन फॉर थ्री मार्क्स एंड फाइव मार्क्स आर रिलेटेड टू डायाग्राम्स एंड सम साइकल्स एंड सम पाथवेज सो दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी सम ऑफ द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट पाथवेज फ्लो चार्ट साइकल्स एंड डायाग्राम्स विच आर सपोज टू कम फॉर द एग्जाम इन फर्स्ट चैप्टर द लिविंग वर्ल्ड टैक्सोनॉमिक हैरारकी पाथवे फ्लो चार्ट इज़ वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर टू मार्क्स देन इन बायोलॉजिकल क्लासिफिकेशन शेप ऑफ द बैक्टीरिया शेप ऑफ द बैक्टीरिया कॉकई बैसिलई स्पैरिला विब्रियो इज आल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर टू मार्क्स देन द डायग्राम ऑफ नॉस्टॉक सयोनो बैक्टीरिया और ब्लू ग्रीन आलगे इज आल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फ्रॉम बायोलॉजिकल क्लासिफिकेशन चैप्टर देन अदर टू डायाग्राम्स इन बायोलॉजिकल क्लासिफिकेशन चैप्टर इज टोबैको मौजिया वायरस डायाग्राम एंड बैक्टीरियो फेज डायाग्राम दीज टू आर वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एनी वन ऑफ दिस आर कंपलसरी क्वेश्चन फॉर द एग्जाम देन फ्रॉम द चैप्टर मार्फोलॉजी ऑफ फ्लवरिंग प्लांट्स वन ऑफ द थ्री मार्क्स इंपॉर्टेंट डायाग्राम इज द डिफरेंट रीजन्स ऑफ द रूट टिप इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड फ्रॉम द डायाग्राम्स इट इज ईजी टू स्कोर द मार्क्स बट द कंडीशन इज यू नीड टू प्रैक्टिस अ लॉट द डायाग्राम्स विद द विद देयर लेबलिंग्स then in morphology of flowering plants one more uh, five marks important question is estivation so this is these are the diagrammatic representation of four types of estivation which are very important then another important topic from this morphology chapter is placentation placentation and its types these are the five types of placentation which are very important to the exam then another three marks question from this chapter is the diagram of monocot seed or maize seed are very highly important then uh, from the chapter anatomy of flowering plants the diagram of dicot root is very important for five marks or they may ask you to write the diagram of monocot root either dicot root or monocot root are highly important for five marks even monocot leaf diagram also very important to the exam and dicot leaf diagram also very very important to the exam then from the chapter structural organization of uh, structural organization in animals digestive system of frog diagram is very important so this is the diagrammatic representation of internal organ of frog showing the complete digestive system is also very very important another important five marks question from this chapter is frog male reproductive system diagram or they may ask you to draw the female reproductive system diagram of frog either male reproductive system or female reproductive system is highly important for five marks then the next chapter is the cell is unit of life from cell chapter either plant cell diagram or animal cell diagram is highly important for five marks apart from that fluid mosaic model of plasma membrane diagram is also highly important for five marks proposed by singer and nicolson then mitochondria labeled diagram is also very important then another important diagram from this chapter is that structure of chloroplast then the types of chromosome based on the position of centromere it is also very very important for two marks question then from the chapter cell cycle uh metaphase or anaphase diagram they may ask in the exam for two marks then from photosynthesis in higher uh, higher plants the representation of cyclic photophosphorylation or the representation of non cyclic photophosphorylation non cyclic photophosphorylation is also called as z scheme so that is also very important for three marks then from photosynthesis chapter uh, there is one pathway which is very important for five marks to actually two pathways one is kelvin cycle also called as dark cycle or c3 cycle very important for five marks then one more pathway for five marks is c4 pathway or hatch slack cycle is also very important from this chapter then uh, from respiration in plants chapter a compulsory question for exam is glycolysis pathway glycolysis or krebs cycle any one among them are very very important so this is the representation of glycolysis pathway very important for five marks it includes 10 steps or they may ask you to uh, draw the cycle of krebs cycle krebs cycle or tca cycle or citric acid cycle is also very very important 
from breathing and exchange of gases human respiratory system diagram is very very important then from body fluids and circulation chapter human heart diagram is also very important for 5 marks from this chapter they may ask you to represent the ecg graph for 2 marks then from the chapter excretory products and their elimination for 3 marks they may ask you to draw the diagram of human urinary system or for 5 marks they'll ask you to draw the diagram of nephron are very very important then from the chapter neural control and coordination neuron diagram very very important for 5 marks or they'll ask you to draw human brain diagram so these are a very important uh, diagrams flow charts and pathways from first pc biology from this only maximum 25 to 30 marks you will get definitely in annual exam i hope this video is very helpful for you thank you